YouTube family. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Crystal and this is my channel, Crystal Saves Cash. On this channel, we talk about all things lifestyle, couponing, saving money, do it on a dime, DIY, all that type of stuff. If you are interested in that type of content, give me a like, comment, and subscribe and keep on watching. So today I have for you all a Dollar Tree haul going back to what I used to do long, long time ago. I hadn't been to the Dollar Tree in a little bit. So I've been going to a couple of different stores and I've been finding some really, really cute things. So I have a few ideas for some DIY projects that I want to do, some tablescapes that I want to do. So I'm just trying to get my uh, materials and things together. So without further ado, let me go ahead and show you all some of the stuff that I got. Um, first thing I got, you know, trying to get my diet together and I found these cute little, um, what do you call these? containers and lids, Tupperware for lack of a better term. But yeah, they come in various different colors. So I got three. I think there might be another color. But one of the things that I like about this particular container is like, well, what's so special about, you know, a container? What's special about these containers is this right here. This is the little ice pack that you can put this part in the freezer. You see the liquid inside of there. So you put this part in the freezer and then it gets cold and it freezes. And then you just pop it back in the inside and then you put your lid back on here. And now whatever contents you put in here have, you know, something to stay cold with. So this is good. Like if you're on the go or if you're like, you know, where I I am at my particular job or any job where there's a lot of people, refrigerator space might be a premium, you know, so if you don't get there first, you might not get your lunch in the refrigerator. So having something like this is actually beneficial for that. Because then it's like you can, you know, depending on how long it's not going to be refrigerated, you can keep your stuff there um, at your desk. The other, some more things, items that I found along that line are just these little Tupperware containers or storage bins, should I say. I, I purchased these for, I like the color, not 100% sure what I'm going to do with them, but one thing I do like about them is the fact that you can, um, push this little lever down like that. They have one on both sides and then they become stackable. Let's see if I can do this there we go so they become stackable like that so you can use this to store craft items just any little thing that you can think of these are great they also have other colors in these as well something else that i was excited to find is this right here this to-do list so this you could you know like i could actually place this here on my wall, you know, tack it up there and write down, it says, do it now. And then it also says, do it later on that side. And you have your little check boxes. You can use either a dry erase. Honestly, I think wet erase would probably be better for this. It is laminated on the front side, but it's, it's not really laminated on the back side. If you wanted to, to make this even more durable you could actually take this to say fedex kinko's wherever your office store and have them laminate this to make this even more durable but just buying it by itself it does have a sheen on the front but i think wet erase would work better on this they did have another one which i'll insert a picture of that one which was like a, a, a landscape you know going this way um planner almost like weekly planner or something like that but yeah i'll insert the picture so you can see it the next thing i found is this cute little sign that says farm fresh fall everybody's in love with this truck i am noticing that more stores now have gotten on board with this little truck thing i am starting to see this everywhere in so many different colors so this is going to be for some fall decor um going along with and y'all i'm not going in any particular order just grabbing the bags as i see them more stuff to help me with my um diet i got these meal prep containers i this was my first time seeing these in the round i do already have the rectangular ones that have the two um 
two sections but i didn't have round so i want to get into eating more salad and these will be perfect for carrying my salads to and from work so i got two of these and y'all this particular this is rubber made and the black ones the rectangular ones i have i mean i've been using those at least over a year and they are still in great shape let's see um some more things that i got here this is something for an idea I have to use at work for labeling some stuff. I got these chalkboard tags. I got the chalkboard marker to use and they're going on something that's metal. So this is a wood magnet because since I'm going to be using this at work, I don't want it to damage the um, item that I'm going to put this on. So that's why I want it it to be a magnet so it can stick on there without damaging the item and you can easily take it back off so this is going to be used at work this was something i got um this is just one of those nighttime eye masks i use this for a prop which you'll see that in one of my shorts so like, this is where i got it from if anybody's interested some more diy fall decor items that i got i think i missed one i found this it's a c of course my name is crystal so i got this in the c i found the wood signs i got this one that says gather this one that says home and this one that says thankful so yeah i'll be utilizing these in some capacity I think I missed something. Uh, I didn't. Um, let's see. I've been to so many different places. I didn't almost forgot what's in these bags. So it's almost like, you know, something new for you and something new for me. It's like, okay, what's this? Okay. All uh, right, nothing special here. Gum. Um. What else do we have? Ooh, okay. This is why I tied this one up. So I, I have some ideas for these. I got the Dove. Um, this is the Cool Moisture Beauty Bar Cucumber and Green Tea Fresh Scent. And y'all, this one is partially open. And that's why I had the bag tied up because, ooh, this one, it smells so good. I mean, the bag is just so fragrant just because of this. And then I also got the Pink Rose. I'm going to go ahead and put these back in the bag and tie them back up because that cucumber one oh my gosh it is so fragrant but it is so good i can't wait to do what i have planned for that one um the next thing i got here we go some more diy type of stuff um i got these eight piece Ooh, it's open I got this eight piece. These are, I don't even know what you call these, but I have an idea of some fall decor of what I'm gonna use for that. So these, this is in a leaf shape. And then this one is in the shape of a pumpkin. The next thing I got going along again with my healthy journey to get, you know, healthy, I found, I started eating for the first time avocados and i found the avocado tool so i was happy to get that now this particular item i was shocked to see in the dollar tree but if you see this you should really really get this this is your quick survive fire starters lights any fire fast so this is something a good survival kit item you may want to keep this in your car or keep this in your um toolbox or something or wherever in your house to have so in case the lights or something go off it says quick dissolve is a weatherproof fire starter that works under the most extreme conditions for our propri our proprietary formula is engineered to sustain an intense flame that can reach over one foot in height while producing a continuous burn time up to 10 minutes quick survive pouches have a shelf life of over 30 years i at the time i found this I, they only had two so yeah i'm gonna go back and get some more of these and give these out to some um family members and stuff but yeah this is something you you should have this in your survival kit the next thing i picked up uh this is a collapsible reef 
stand and y'all i actually got this my intentions for this was i was thinking with the diy project that i would probably be able to post this on here i thought this was something different than what it was so we'll see you know what i end up doing with this some more items that i found let's open up this bag let's see what's in here okay okay so in here we have the wet and wild this is your eyeliner in the color brown i've used the dollar tree eyeliners for a while now i love these eyeliners you know i have high-end cosmetics and i have low-end cosmetics so in a bunch that one works very very well i also picked up a new dog harness this is a small so i got that for the fur baby and here we have something that every female should have. These are your reusable covers. These are for, you know, your breast area. And I like these. I keep these all the time. Whenever I, and I got three of them. Whenever I see them, I pick them up because, you know, working in an office setting where there are people of the opposite sex, men, women, whatever, you want, I, I just don't like that feeling of, you know, what happens when a female gets cold. So that's what these are for. They're also very good for working out. I actually use them when I'm working out. I put these in my sports bras as well because I just don't like walking around, you know, with, with your headlights on. So, and I also got the fashion tape. This is for, you have your blouse that, you know, it's buttoned here and it's buttoned there, but then you might have that little gap. So this is what, y'all, this is what this is for to help keep that closed. So that's that. Um, this is something I picked this up, but I do not recommend this. This is your spa scent spot scent vent clips and i don't know what the fragrance is but yeah this one i think it's vanilla or something like that but yeah this one is this doesn't work well so save your dollar on this don't pick this up i need to hurry up this video is getting long y'all the next items that i picked up are i did find this clipboard in the b so i like that i found these particular notebooks these are spiral notebooks all of them have a coffee theme and I, I you know i really really like coffee so i was excited to see these and there's that one let's see we got another bag right here let's see what's in this particular bag okay so i picked these up these are beauty jars and the reason why I got these is because if you're traveling and say you're going on an airplane and you know you can't take um, full size products such as this. So, you know, I don't really like to buy trial size products or travel size products. Go to the Dollar Tree, get you these and then you can take your full size products squirt them into these and there you have your own travel size products and you didn't have to go buy something in addition to what you already have. The next thing I picked up were these are the Shea Moisture African Black Soap Clarifying Facial Wipes. I did get two packages of these and I have been trying them already. Now, this has, it says, balance oily blemish prone skin. It's with tea tree and calendula. Now, tea tree oil. Now, tea tree oil is very, very good for your skin, but I will say when I opened this up and I used it for the first time, it did, feel, I did feel like a little burning, tingling sensation on my skin. So, and I did use it on my face, but so, I don't know. I say, I will say, I think it's worth a dollar. You don't have to put it on your skin. Maybe put it on, the, on your face. Maybe put it on the rest of your body, but I did get these. I bought two of these. I found this little candle. This is a coconut marshmallow candle. And I, on cold, 
this smells really really good i have been a little leery of the dollar tree candles because sometimes the throw or oftentimes the throw on it is not very well but one of the things i do like that i sometimes pick this up is more so for the jar than for the candle itself so once i burn the candle and use it up i will clean out the jar and keep that so that's what i have in there now I did find a brand new Dollar Tree. I was out and about one weekend, saw it, and it was brand new, grand opening. I didn't get a chance to go that day, but I did get a chance to go back again the, um, a week later. Now, they had taken down the grand opening sign, but I still went. I did ask the... Um, cashier how long had the store been open and she said that they only been open for about a month so i did find some really really good items in that particular store so here's the first item that i found look at the glass y'all this glass it says good things will happen and this i guess this would be a wine glass i'm not sure but drink whatever you want out of it you know but yeah this is very very pretty i'm gonna put this right here the next thing i found in those that store look at this y'all these are just to me you use these for planting but you can use it for anything whatever you want so this one says farm fresh pumpkins then you have this one that says always be thankful and you have this one that says give thanks so aren't these just the cutest thing you know i mean you could use these for whatever you want planting something diy projects um you can even put school supplies and stuff in this the next thing i picked up out of that store y'all i am just a glutton for punishment when it comes to reusable tumblers i have so many reusable tumblers but and i keep buying them but i could not pass this up again there's that truck this time is blue so yeah i got that um another thing i picked up this one is a rub on transfer sticker and this one was just randomly laid around in the store so but it says pumpkin spice and everything nice so i love that um the next thing i picked up i got one other thing i was so excited to see these is these here, these are the Essie Leg Wear. It's one pair of non-slip gel microfiber with aloe infused socks. Now, I really, really like these. I've been using these for quite some time now, but I could not find them in the black. The first time I found them, I got them in... Um, camel brownish type of color so and i had been looking for the black but that was over a year ago and i finally found them again so i was excited to finally get these in black so when i saw them i grabbed four and the last thing i got out that particular store oh wait one more thing i got this was something basic i got this to keep in my car how many times am i in my car nail breaks or something like that and i can't find my nail file so i actually got this whole entire set that i'm going to leave in my car and the last thing I got were, I got two books. This one, it says Brooklyn Street Style, The No Rules Guide to Fashion. So yeah, I was excited to see this. I can't wait to really, really delve into this. And then y'all, look at this one. It says the career code must know rules for a strategic, stylish, and self-made career. Plus 27 life hacks every woman should master. I probably should have got more than one. They had maybe like five of them, but I only got one. But this, I should have got more. This would have made a good gift for somebody. But maybe if I have time, I'll go back and see if I can get another one. But yeah, so that is the last thing that I got. And this is one of my favorite items. I can't wait to really, really get into this and see what I can learn from this. So that is all that I have for you all today. That is what I picked up at the Dollar Tree over the course of maybe a week or so. I hope you all, if you see some of the things in here that you like, go out and look and see if you can find them. I mean, they're $1.00. Don't go ham in the story if, you know, that's not within your budget, but do what you do. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.